Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back, and right now we are looking at the rain, at our other village, Village 2 as I decided to call it, um, looking at the villagers in the, in the rain over there, the rain, the rain, but, and we're in this nice little house that still is not finished, but it rains from the inside, um, well, let's recap on things that I have done off camera. First, let's toggle down uh, Rain stop. How do I do that? Discourse on this work I've received achievement. Channel title. <laughs> Talk oh, you gotta be kidding me. Let's do this. Ah. Uh. Talk about that. Okay. So, things that have happened. Alright, so. I have some people. So, we all know that this lovely dude. That, uh, he buys our, uh, raw chicken and gives us emeralds. He's my main source. But I got these two guys. Alright, this weaponsmith. Coal for an emerald. Alright. I haven't bought anything from him, though. 17 coal for an emerald, and I get a pretty good pickaxe. And this dude, this dude is a beast. 26 paper for an emerald, but he also gives us an efficiency 5 book for 57, of course. That's crazy, right? That's straight up crazy. I found him over in this village, and it was, it was dope. And then we still have the sunbathing thing. Alright, and we got those trees that are trying to grow. Also, alright, uh, what else have I done? Oh, no. That thing up there, yeah. This thing up here. Mm. Uh, ah, all right. Whoa, bud. And uh, I built this enchantment table. It goes all the way up to level 30, so that's good. All right. Uh, another thing that I've been done is that new house right there. Ah, uh, yes, this new house, pretty dope. I like it. I'll just hang out in there. Um. Dude, you, you be living, oh, I forgot to do this, yeah, alright, but, uh, you're, you're gonna have to go, okay, good, uh, yeah, they can jump that, okay, okie dokie then, um, now they can't, there's a lot of villagers because they've been breeding off camera, I've, it's been a while since I've done this episode, so there's a lot of villagers, like, a lot, um, so, the plan today, I have uh, 11, 12 minutes left for this video, um, what we are going to do is, I'm going to show you something, something pretty neat, and I don't think I've shown this off in the other videos, but I've known about it for a while, we head down here, oh hello, oh I killed them because I needed like a stack of chicken, and there should be some more cooking actually, so. So, uh, there's a little cool, little neat thing down here that I have, uh, found. Not really found, but stuff. Uh, actually, I did find it. Um, let's see if I remember where it is. It's, like, way down there. So, I'll do a quick cut, and when I get down there, it'll be good. Be right back. Okay, so that took me quite a long time I had 52 all right uh, so I've already looted this place and I already put torches as you can see but as you can see it's a spawner spawner good spawner real good um <coughs> so the way that I'm thinking we do this is we suspend this up in the air so we can't break the spawner of course well look at this dude Whoa. Uh, we're gonna break, we're gonna break down the floor, I think it, we're gonna go down a few blocks, like, three or four or five. I'm thinking five. We're gonna have water that's pushing the zombies into an area, like, right here. Then there's gonna be, like, a, like, a, one of those sign, sign water things. Sign water things in, uh, in a, you know, in a thing. You know, sign in water, and then they'll go in, then they'll flow right up, and then you can just kill them, like, uh, with a sword or something, like a stone sword. And then the XP will be, uh, given to you, and then we'll have a hopper that gives all the, uh, 
rotten flesh, and then that rotten flesh will go to my cleric, so that will, and the cleric is at my place, if you didn't know. Um, so yeah, that's what's gonna happen. So I'm gonna go build this in a, in a, my redstone testing world, and, uh, we'll take it from there, so I will see you in that place. Alright, cool. Okay, I just finished it. So, this is probably one of the easiest designs you could ever get. It's a box. So, if we hop inside this box, we'll see what I got going on here. So, here's the spawner, right? It's one block high, so the zombies can't spawn on it. We have water flowing in, and it's flowing just at the edge. So, when they'll spawn, they're going to spawn, like, up here. So, once they spawn, they're going to drop down. So, in zombies, they always float. So, I'm going to hold the space bar. So, I'm going to probably have to open this up a little bit. That might be a little bit of a problem, so we're going to keep that. So they're just going to, they, they bob up and down. So once they actually, they'll hit it. So once they hit it, they'll jump. And then they'll go up, and then get pushed out here into the killer. That's the plan. Yeah. So that's what it is. So let's try this on some zombies. So I'm going to type in some zombies. Spawn them all in. Alright, so we're gonna do like a little trapping thing here. To trap the bastards. And we just gotta trap these guys, you know? Gotta hit the soda. So they'll, they'll get trapped in here. Alright, so. Let us see if this is working. So we're gonna go. Boop. Let's watch this guy. Oh, god damn. Uh, yeah, easy. Bam. So he's gonna fall down. It's not looking at me because I'm not in the area. Because I'm in creative. So we're going to follow this guy. So let's see if he pops out. Are you going to come? Bud. Oh, uh, what's going on here? He's not jumping. So what I need to do is I need to... Uh, reestablish this water bucket, I think. It's not long enough. Like that. Yeah. Now he's bobbing, but it's not really helping. So, yeah, see, I need him to get in the water. Yeah, we're gonna kill you, bud. Sorry you died for a noble cause. We're just troubleshooting this a uh, little... Oh, there he goes. Well, we know that's working now. So, we need to... Place this here, and then place this water bucket here. That's gonna be a problem. Oh! Well, you get the gist, alright? So... If we just literally do this... There. Alright, now it's gonna work. <sighs> there we go. Alright, let's try this on some zombies. So we spawn three in. Gonna fall into the, uh, the trapper. It's, they're gonna bob up and down. They will get hit, though, by one another. They'll go in, and then will they float up? There! Is it working? I think it's working. It's working! Yay! Alright! I'm gonna go build this. I might make it a time lapse. I don't know. Uh, we'll see. Well, this zombie spawner is working, so I'm gonna go build it real quick. You guys know how it looks. You guys know. All right. So, see you guys when it's done. Yeah. <laughs>
finished the water. If you, if I did put in the time lapse, then I did, and you probably saw that, or you just skipped ahead. But it is time that we destroy the torches. There they go. They're starting. All right, we're just gonna. Uh, all right, and I did put in a thing. All right, so let's go check this out. If they did and are spawning, they will go up here. There. There we go. And you just assassinate them. There we go. Oh, it's working. Awesome. That's what I wanted. All right, so. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. All right, I'm going to AFK here for a few minutes, get 30 levels, and then we're going to go enchant a sword, baby. That's what we're going to be doing. Woo! Alright, <clears throat> so I'm back. I uh, kind of screwed up my recording. Uh, everything else is good except for the last part uh, where I got my 30 levels and then I came back and I did the enchantment. So we're going to do like a little spleef there. Alright, so uh, uh, boop -a -doop -a -doop, uh, coming back. Oh, I'm going to enchant my sword now. Hopefully I can get a good sword. Um, wow. Ooh, what? It's Smite 4. Well, we all know what it's going to be now. Click. Ah, uh, wow! God dang it, Smite Four! What the heck? Mm, well, at least this will be very efficient in the new spotter that we have. Yay! I'm so happy about a Smite Four sword as our first level 30 sword enchantment. I'm so happy. <sighs> I have a fantastic freaking day, people. Hopefully, you have enjoyed. If you have, make sure you slap that like button. Just slap it. Pop, pop, pop. And if you didn't like it, tell me what I could probably do better. Because we all know that I've been doing YouTube for about two months. And that's not enough time to do my stuff. You know what I mean? Dang. I can do a pie. So, yeah. Tell me what I did wrong. Uh, anything I could improve on. And, uh, yeah. That'll be good. Uh, if you guys have enjoyed the time lapse, tell me in the comments below. Uh, because that it really helps me with my stuff. Because if I can do more time lapses, that'll it just makes it easier on me. Because I like uh, using new music I have. Uh, hopefully, it's working with YouTube and all that shiblang. So hopefully, I'm not rambling on too much. Um, this video is probably gonna be like 25 minutes long. It's bullcrap. Uh, now let's see if I can go get a time lapse to work. Yeah. Bye bye. Boop.